What's going on guys? Linus here. Welcome back to Game Dev Tycoon. Let's uh, keep going. So what I forgot in the last part is that the um, my employees were all really tired. Look at that. The bar just blends in with the desks and I never even realized it. So let's send these idiots on vacation. Well, that's why they were basically contributing nothing. So that's uh, good to know, I guess. Let's do some contract work. That's pretty easy. Let's go with this one. We got the design master right here, so I'm pretty sure we should be able to to do that quite easily. Yeah, you got it. Let's uh, let's see. Train him in the art of uh, technology. Uh, yeah, let's go with that. Let's do this. Twinkle suckers, it made me ten and a half million. Still pretty good, honestly, for a uh, for a crappy vampire game. And with these stupid employees that don't actually do anything. Take a vacation real quick. But be back soon. Uh, let's do some more contract work because we have to wait until the other dude's back. Sure, debug program. We should be able to do that. Why the hell not? And there you go. Pretty good. Got it. Uh, I think everyone's back. Oh, there's now this dude needs a vacation. Take a real quick vacation. We're gonna start working on a new game. Uh, let's see. Mystery. Let's make a mystery adventure game. Seems like it would go best with adventure, so let's just do that on the. Um, let's see. Mbox 360, the play system, and the uh, the GS. It's gonna be a medium game on my, my best engine. It will be a pretty expensive game. But I think it's gonna do quite well. At least I hope it will. And everybody's back. Come on, get to work. Hey, what are you doing? That fucking guy. Uh, story's probably very important. Uh, engine, uh, a little, I guess. I don't really know. Gameplay, not so much. I'll take care of that. Marcus will take care of that. And oh, let's have Colton do this one. Uh, let's go. Now, hopefully, now that everyone has actually uh, been on vacation and they're all, you know, chill and stuff, and they have energy, hopefully they can actually make a game now and not suck for once. Because I really got to start making some more money. Especially if I'm going to be investing like a million dollars every game. There's not going to be a lot of games for me to make anymore, so let's do it. Oh, boy. Uh, let's see, blah, blah, blah. Uh, yeah, give away the engine, get extra fans, always a good thing, you know. Dialogue, AI, not very important. Level design, probably quite important, so let's go with something like this. Uh, let's see, this is technology, so I'll take care of this. Then Colton will take care of that. And Marcus, yeah, I think we are a good uh, AI. Huh, so if you put in that stuff, you get an incomplete game. It's what someone told me. So basically, if you want that, you're going to have to put, uh... Oh, that's how it works. Okay. Let's put it down. Let's take it out. So that it's not incomplete. And, uh, we're good. Uh, so for level design, you actually don't need that much. Um, yeah, okay, let's go. Here we go. Okay, 17.7k fans, and it cost us 3.3k, so... Honestly, it's not bad. That's a lot of fans we just got from that. Oh man, look at this. Technology's still lagging behind a little- Oh, I forgot to rename the game. <laughs> Oops. Now it's game 35. Oh, whatever. Um, so I should probably hire someone else as soon as I can. A, a technology expert. Uh, because that would be pretty awesome. World design is probably quite important. Sound, I am assuming... Uh, open world. Virtual economy. Yeah, let's actually get rid of the virtual economy. Sounds, uh... What the hell? Soundtrack, but I want all of that. Come on, okay. I'll stereo sound. Uh, monos. I don't like that. Leave the soundtrack then. Can go pretty much like that. Graphics are, uh, just fine. There we go. And world design is probably very important, so I want to go with that, definitely. Uh, Colton, take care of the world design, and I'll have Sarah do this then. To sort of even that out. Or actually, Sarah, you do that. Colton, you do that. Yep, there you go. Uh, we're good. Let's see how this uh, plays out. 
technology is really low. Crap, so I gotta figure uh, figure out a way to hire someone really good at that. And hope that this game actually sells well, because that would be nice. Look at the hype. I haven't even done anything and the hype is just... Giant. Giant hype. At least the, the technology reached 100. Now hopefully by the time that the bugs are gone, we should have our uh, booth. Get a little bit of extra... Uh... Ah, it's fine. It's fine. Just sell it. Game 35. Okay. Uh, I can actually rename the game here, so let's do that. It's gonna be- it's a mystery game, so we're gonna call it Scooby- Scooby Doge. It's, uh, super funny memes. Uh, yeah, 3D graphics. Let's go. Skill trees. Let's just see how well this game does, then. Generate game report. Here we go. We got reviews. Please be gentle. An 8. That's actually- okay. That's okay. How about, uh, well, another 8. How about some nines? Guys, come on. What is seven? No, 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 no. An eight. Okay. Well, I guess we're not doing as hot as I was hoping that we would. Let's see uh, we can get some fans here. Strong audience is mature. Uh, guess I kind of forgot about that. Oh, that's pretty good. Top 100. Sweet. First time ever. See, what's the point of that? That's weird. People told me that later you get like some new stuff you can you can use that for, but still, I, I just think it's still weird. I'm, I'm just gonna be honest with you guys. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna train this guy in technology. Uh, yeah, technology. So there you go. This guy. Train. That's 100 RP, so I can't really do that. Uh, let's see. About Sarah needs training because she kind of sucks right now. Uh, you get the programming course. And that in the meantime... Oh, actually, the game is selling pretty okay. Great combo. Our AI is not important. Platforms, every, all the matches are good, so that's nice. Still new to the team. He will have higher potential. Okay, well, that's good. Complex algorithms. Let's invest about a million dollars. Let's look for a really, really good technology person. Uh, okay. That's actually... It's selling quite well. Oh, the grip head. That sounds uh, dope. Create custom engine. No, that, that's not what I mean. Uh, contract work is what I want to do. Let's make this. Should be quite easy, so... You know, whatever. And I think we're actually going to sell a million copies again, which is nice. Jessica Briggs, holy shit. What is it? It's 37k a month. Ben Sir, I, I'm going to hire her. You better believe it. She's got great speed, too, so... Welcome to the team, girl. Train. Steph, welcome training. Uh, take a vacation. No, you, man. What the? Why can I not send them away? It's not like they're doing anything. Okay. Wrecked up over one million seals, so that's actually pretty good. You know, I was expecting a lot worse, so... Pretty happy about that. Pretty happy. Uh, why can I not send anyone away on vacation? Like, seriously. Oh, probably because they all take part in this training thing with her. They all, like, welcome her to the team and stuff. Okay, then. Let's see if we can actually do contract work. Fight with a low penalty. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, so they all do still work. That's good, then. Come on, guys. You're the fuck up. Uh, research, video playback, mini games, large games. <clears throat> I'm guessing large games could be nice. So let's uh, let's research that right now. In the meantime, you guys do some more contract work, so that you at least you know do something useful. There you go. Uh, let's do some more contract work. Let's uh, let's do that one. Let's do a bigger contract finally. I've been putting that off since forever, and I'm pretty sure they can uh, can do that pretty easily, which is nice. Okay, you have more than 250k fans. Should I? Okay, self-published large games. That's good, though. 
Off the market. Holy shit. So we made 14 million off of that game. That's nice. Uh, let's develop. Can I send them away? Yes, I can. Welcome to the team. Now take a vacation. Can't do that, but that would have been funny. Uh, let's see. Contract work. Let's do one more. Time tracking. Pretty sure we can do this, so we should be okay. Yeah, we can do this. She is contributing a lot of technology, so that's nice. Uh, looking for sponsors. Sure, I'll sponsor your whatever. Uh, thanks for the money. Oh, oops, nope. Let's develop a sequel. It's time to, for an old classic to revisit that. Twinkle Suckers, Thumbweed Humpers, Metal of Duty Field, Dirty Casual Music. See, that made me a lot of money, so I want to revisit that. Um, casual Scum. Uh, let's just call it that. Scum Beats. People are going to love it. It's uh, for mature... Uh, no, let's make it for everyone. It's casual. Good platform for casual games is obviously this thing. Pretty sure it should be. Does not... Sp okay, well, medium game, though, whatever. Uh, yep, that phone. There you go. And also the pad. Pretty sure it's, it's going to do well. Uh, it's casual music game. My best engine. Let's make this thing. There we go. Let's see how they... Oh, really? You need a vacation right now? I'll go immediately then, you idiot. Gameplay, very important. Engine and story quests are not very important at all. Let's take that out of there. Engine is... Let's take everything out. Pretty much except for... Save to cloud, I guess. Gameplay is fine. So we're going full on gameplay. Uh, Marks will take care of that. Uh, yeah, we're looking uh, good. Actually, she can take care of that and go. Let's see what happens. Oh wait, this guy isn't even here. Why would the game allow me to assign him if he's not- Oh, uh, at least he's back now, so that's okay. No strong trends, that's okay, because I wasn't working on anything for a mature audience anyway. Oh, Arnie Kunkel, an uh, interview, okay. Uh, let's be modest, again. <clears throat> I have a feeling that this game is not going to be amazingly, uh, amazingly great, so yeah. See more women in the game industry. Uh, well, sure, why the hell not? I don't really care about the whole thing. Let's just get, I just want to get my money. Level design, dialogue is probably not very important at all. Let's get that the hell out of there. Um, yeah, that's not going to do. Let's see. Uh, Marcus should really take care of that, but he can't right now. So I will take care of it instead. Uh, for just for this time and then Let's see I want you to do that as well. Uh, yeah, let's go Come on we can do this guys. All we need is a lot of technology You know that would be pretty sweet At least it should be a little bit higher than my previous games, but I have a feeling that it's still gonna be a little underwhelming but she still needs to adjust to the team and everything and then as soon as she gets gets used to making my technology bubbles, then she'll be okay. Well, actually, this isn't bad at all. Um, crap, I don't really know what to go with here. Probably not world design. Probably graphics and a little bit of sound, maybe? I don't know. Um, yeah, I will have her take care of uh, this. I will take care of that. And I'll have Colton do this one instead. To sort of balance that out and stuff. Uh, let's get rid of all this stuff. It's going to be an open world music game. Actually, a virtual... Uh, it's not going to work. Uh, yeah, we're good. Let's go. Let's see if I picked the right things here. I really hope I did. Because it's time for another smash hit. Oh, this is actually... This is shaping up to be pretty okay. Definitely better than the stuff that I've put out in the latest uh, whatever. Um, sure, let's go with the medium booth. Why the hell not? I should be top 100 again, so that's sweet. I think we're gonna break a record or two here. Also, shitload of bugs. I'm not really sure how I feel about that. Let's get those out of here. Look at that hype, man. I mean, that's insane. Come on, hurry up. Get some- okay. Oh boy, that's just gonna increase the hype, even though I was modest about the game. I don't like that. No, I do not. 600. Holy shit, that's a lot of people right there. 
83. That's pretty good. No. Come on, hurry up. Look at the hype. What the fuck? I didn't even know it went that high. That's insane. New record. Okay, I leveled up, he leveled up, that's all good. Versatile, release a successful game in each of the five main genres. So I guess it's a successful game now, I didn't even know that, but okay. Thanks for telling me in advance that this game is successful. Let's check it out then. How is this, why is this successful now, a seven? Wait, what? Seven and a nine, almost look like a ten right there. It's gonna be another, yep, another seven. How about an eight? Or another nine, that would be pretty cool. Yeah, okay, an eight. So it's a pretty good game. I could deal with it. Let's uh, generate a game report. Oh boy. It is selling pretty well. Not bad at all. <clears throat> Let's see, uh, oh, you need to take a vacation again? I didn't even notice that, you dirty person. Being all sneaky and stuff. Um, Surround sound, full motion video, voice over. Jeez, let's get a new topic maybe. Hunting would be fun. And then you take a vacation and you research video mini games, surround sound. Surround sound could be pretty good, I think. So let's go uh, with that, I guess. Yeah, let's do that. Extra sound stuff. Oh boy. Sold over a million again. Sweet. World design not important. Platform genre match is great. Platform audience match is good. Still new to the team. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I know. Don't worry. I am uh, fully aware of that. Let's see. R&D. I don't want to do that. I want to train my own guy again. Whoa. Engine. Specialization. Gameplay. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, that's cool. So they get specializations now. Uh, I'm going to train him in design. Because uh, I want to, so yeah. There you go. In the meantime, let us do a little bit of contract work. This one is easy enough, so let's do that. Oh my god, that's, uh, yeah. It's too easy. And we get no research points again. Uh, I feel like we should... Let's see, if I make another engine, I don't think I can actually include a lot more... Oh boy, that's a big one right there. And that one is also quite... Okay, so that's three million. I do feel like, like we should make that, so if everyone is ready, I will actually make that engine. What the hell is this? Okay. Grapple... Okay, well, oh, that's cool, I guess. I don't really care about that. Uh, let's make an engine, guys. Let's make it amazing. Yep, there you go. And the surround sound, and that's all I need. 3M future, because it's the, the engine of the future. Let's make it, dudes. Now, hopefully, with the inclusion of these two guys, it should actually go a lot smoother than my last engine. Oh my god, I almost sold 2 million. I sold 2 million. That's some good sales right there. I probably made a buttload of money off of this game, then. Casual scum beats. Oh my god, so maybe almost 22 million. That's that's quite good, I like that. I like making lots of money with uh, stupid casual games. Here we go. Oh boy, this is really going really fast. Holy crap. Invest over 1 million in the new game engine. Yeah, I did that. I admit. Ooh, the woo. Okay. Uh, yeah, no, it looks, looks cool. Looks cool. Uh, develop a new game. Let's go with something completely new. We're making a hunting simulator for mature audiences on the, uh, the PC. Where's the PC? Where's my PC? Here it is. Pretty sure that, that goes well with mature audiences. Maybe the, um... Uh, let's just bring it out on a bunch of platforms, see how that how well that does. We're bringing it out on the 3M Future Engine. It's going to be a large game. And it's going to be called uh, Turkey Stalker. Where you, uh, you you stalk turkeys and then you kill them. That's, uh, that's how it works. Let's do it. I'm pretty sure that everyone will love it. So, 
feeling pretty confident about this, you know. Uh, let's see, engine, very important. Gameplay, eh, story quest, nope. Let's see what you can put in there. Everything, that's nice. Story, you can pretty much put nothing in there. That's fine, because we really don't need to. Marcus will take care of that. Jessica will take care of that, and I'll take care of that. Uh, yeah, I think we are looking good. A little bit of extra gameplay. Uh, yeah, let's go for it. Maybe even a little bit more. A little bit of gameplay. Yep, we'll go. Let's make it, dudes. This is our most ambitious project yet. Or at least our engine is, like, expensive as shit. Uh, the technology, it looks like I made a really good choice with the slider there, because Jesus Christ. I mean, that's a lot of technology right there. This is the- <laughs> this is the best first, like, phase of development that I've ever had. We got 100-100 within the first stage, what the hell? This is amazing. AI. Level design. Dialogue's not as important, I think. Let's put everything in there. Dialogue's not as important, so... Bit of level design. I'll take care of that myself. Uh, Marks will take care of that, and she'll take care of that. And I think we're looking good. Let's balance it out a little bit. Yep, there you go. Uh, let's make it. Come on, dudes. We're making the best game we've ever even made. Oh, well, look at that. The M-pad has been released. That's uh, cool, I guess. I don't know. Really don't care too much. Uh, adventure games are, uh, well... Bit too late with that one, because I'm not making an adventure game. M-pad is indeed not the same as the grip pad. Well, okay then. Uh, that's not really a surprise, is it? Oh man, technology is actually beating out design for the first time in like ever. Oh boy, this is definitely gonna be the best game I've ever made. Graphics, sound is probably very important in a simulation as well, so let's put surround sound soundtrack in there. Uh, world design, not that important, so let's make it open world. And uh, that's pretty much all I really want to do right now, so you take care of that, I'll take care of this. Actually, let's have Colton do that. Jessica do that, Marcus does the graphics. He's gonna be overworked, but it will be worth it. So, let's just do it. Because he's, he's by far the best designer that I have on the team, so... I just, I just gotta do that, you know? Oh, would you look at that? We're gonna reach 200-200. Platform Woo by an Invento has been released. Cool, cool, cool. Come on, 200-200. Yeah, we did it. 200. Let's go with a medium booth again. It's become tradition in my videos by now that I go with that. Yeah, there you go. Crazy amount of bugs, but it's okay. And three people need to go on a vacation. They can do that as soon as we're done here. They didn't go totally insane. Enjoy the experience, blah, blah, blah. I'll pay you 200k to play some of our fine red painted exploding barrels in one of your games. Uh, sure, dude. Rush those barrels. I'd rather have you place them in a game where they fit well. Johnson out. So we get red exploding barrels. Uh, I, I accept. Sure. I will, I'll take that. Wait, I have marketing now? Ooh, since when can I do this? Okay, I'll not make a bad game successful. Oh, look at that. So we should be able to um, create hype. I think that's what it's going to do. So let's go with a uh, magazines and demos campaign. Let's see what that does. Oh, it's probably because the game was still being made. I didn't even realize this. So the hype is going to be insane now. That should be fun. Oh, boy. We got to reach 700k. Oh, oh, my God. That's nice. Casual scum beats and turkey stalker. Oh yeah. We did well. Let's sell this game now, guys. It's time. The hype is immeasurable. We've got a new record, new combo, everything. 3D graphics sound, everything leveled up. Colton is really close to getting a raise, but he's not quite there yet. Lots of new research available. That's what I like to see. Generate a game report. Generate a game report. Here we go. Our reviews are in. Do we have another smash hit? Really? Come on, man. This is the best game I ever made. I got a seven. An eight. I keep getting the same scores over and over and over. I don't know what I'm doing wrong, but Jesus Christ. Oh, we're getting we're getting a, a, an eight. Yep. That, okay, well, that's pretty good. Should sell, I'm pretty sure it's going to sell pretty well, so... 
Uh, it's acceptable. Uh, let's research. I have a lot of points. Let's go to online play. We're gonna make a. That's our next thing. We're gonna make like this giant online shooter that people will just. They're gonna love it. Um, can't really get anything else right now, so let's save up some more research points. That's you know, it should be fine. As soon as we have 80. Holy fuck! This game is selling like hotcakes. Look at that. Oh boy, we reached a million already. Oh boy. This is a good game. It's making me loads of money. See, it might not be a great game, but people still buy it. That's interesting to me. Uh, video playback, mini games, dynamic environment, simple body language. Uh, let's see. I want to go with the dynamic environment. I'm sure that that would be really great in an online military action game. So yeah, great combo. Graphics important. Platform genre match is good, and platform genre match audience is mature on the PC is great. So lots of uh, mature people are buying this game and they're effectively giving me millions and millions of dollars, which is, uh, of course, welcome. Let's do another contract D Game backdrops, we should do that in like one day. So no worries there. There we go. It's done. Um, let's develop. Let's see, everyone should be okay to go. Develop a new game. It's gonna be a business simulator. Uh, Mbox is pretty good for that, so let's go with it, and maybe the, the Wu might be- No, I don't think the Wu is going to be super great for a, uh, simulator. The PC is good for simulation, so let's go with that. And the, um... Uh, let's just go with, uh, with the Play System 3. Making it a, a, a medium game, a large game, aimed at everyone. And the sim- uh, yeah, there you go, it's going to be on the best uh, engine that I own. And it's going to be called NSA, um... Let's see, what would be a good NSA friendship? Uh, because it's about you play as the head of the NSA and you have friendship with all the citizens because they don't hate your fucking guts. So, uh, yeah, let's let's go with that. Let's make this game. Ooh, Red Exploding Barrels. I can do that now, I guess. Let's just put them in a business simulation, you know. Maybe they sell them. I don't know. They could be in pretty much any game ever. Uh, new will be taken off the market. Let's go with the engine. Uh, gameplay is probably pretty important. Story quest, not so much. Uh, Jessica Briggs, Mark Stoneville. Yeah, looking good. This is exactly how I want it, pretty much. So, let's do it. I think we got this. Let's see if we can make another great game. No strong trends, but that's fine. Man, we are actually... If we make some more smash hits, we are going to reach 100 million. In cash. That's pretty insane. We have lots of money, is what I'm trying to say here. Maybe you want to do an interview? What is your expectation? Why are they always asking me that? Let's, uh, let's be modest again. Let's just be modest. Sure that people will appreciate that more. Oh boy. Would you look at that? This is a pretty good first phase, not gonna lie. Uh, level design quite important. Dialogues, not so much. Uh, yeah, let's just leave it like this. I think we're looking pretty good. And then maybe the last phase, I'll have some, uh, some other suckers take over. News no longer support it, but that's fine, because I'm not actually making anything for that, nor have I ever made a game for it, so it's fine. Okay, so we made about 36 million almost off of this game. Jesus Christ. So I guess the reviews are really not that much of an indication of how well they're going to sell. That's interesting. Oh boy, this is shaping up to be another great game. Would you look at that? Uh, graphics and sound are quite important, so let's uh, go with uh, with this exactly. Uh, I'll have Colton take care of the. Uh, let's see, of the. Yeah, let's, you do that. Sorry, Marcus, but you're gonna have to do that because uh, the stuff. Actually, I could maybe do that, and then I can have Sarah do the. No, that's not gonna work. Crap. Well, let's just uh, overwork Marcus instead of myself, so let's go! Let's see if we can get a new record. Because that would be pretty welcome right about now. Now, these two guys need to take a vacation, so that's not great. Oh boy, they're not generating as much as they used to. Get the fuck out of here. Because you're not contributing anything right now. So it's better to just send them away, you know? Okay, this is shaping up pretty good. It's a really nice, balanced game. 
This is 80 bugs? Are you kidding me? That's insane. That's a crazy amount of bugs right there. And I think we are almost done. Come on, two more technology. Let's balance it out, dudes. Oh, come on. No, stop fucking around. Come on. It was perfectly balanced for like a second. Really? How much are they going to keep doing? Come on, one more technology. One more technology. Okay, fine. Let's just let's just sell it. And it's a French shit. People are going to love it. 3D graphics, a bunch of people leveled up. So now I have to pay all these people a bunch more money. Marx is actually, he's got insane design and still he's pretty cheap. That's nice. I like that. Another special training available for him. Well, that's good for him, I guess. Reviews. Ooh, a nine. Finally, we're back. Back in the game with a nine. An eight. And another eight. How about another nine? Ah, uh, seven. Uh, I'll take it. Whatever. Uh, could have been worse. Uh, let's go with the medium booth. Why the hell not? Generate a game report. I want you to research. Um, let's see. We could actually go with a... Uh, yeah, let's go with a completely new beautiful graphics. People are going to love this. Uh, I'm going to train... Oh, I don't have research points anymore. So there will be no training. Let's make a website, guys. There you go. I'm sure they'll be able to do this. Oh boy, this game is also selling uh, pretty freaking well. Oh man. They didn't like the red barrels. Are you kidding me? Pretty sure they should have enjoyed it, but okay then. Now I want to get some more research points so I can actually um, make an impressive new engine. With the new graphics and everything, and I want to make a giant military war game on the internet. It's going to be super popular. Oh, man. This is the best I've ever done. Look at that. Place 53. That's not bad at all. Totally not bad. We're going to sell another... Oh, so I'm actually getting close to 100, uh, 100 million dollars. Holy shit. Story not important. Platform sharing much great. Platform audience match is great. So that's nice. That's what I like to see. Now, let's check out an engine before I go. What can I really put in there? Online play is pretty important stuff. And dynamic environments are important as well. I got some pretty good, nice stuff. So anyway, I'm going to do that in the next video. Uh, I'm going to end it here, actually. I hope you guys enjoyed this part. And the next part, we're going to make another giant online uh, military war game, which I hope is actually going to do really well. So, uh... We'll see about that. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll be back soon with more Game Dev Tycoon.